Good Tuesday morning and welcome to WLF Alpha's Two Minute Tuesday. I am Jerry Gano. For many areas of the Plains Alfalfa production area, there's opportunity to seed alfalfa behind corn silage. This effort takes additional grower management that focuses on proper field preparation, timing of the alfalfa seeding, water availability, and more. All these need to be coordinated to establish our new stand of alfalfa and position it for optimum fall growth and ready for a full season of production the following year. Here are some management tips for implementing a plan for seeding alfalfa behind corn silage. Number one, make certain that there was no chemistry applied to the corn that would impact alfalfa germination and establishment. Number two, plan silage harvest with establishing your alfalfa field in mind. Any delay here will be detrimental to fall growth and a well-established alfalfa field going into winter. Make every effort to get the corn off as quickly as possible. Number three, most of the time some tillage of the field will be needed. Make this a priority and get the field ready for seeding as quickly as possible. Number four, the most often asked question from growers planning to seed alfalfa behind corn silage is, how late can I plant my alfalfa? Our mindset must change to a different question. How quickly can I get my alfalfa planted into an ideal seed bed? And the reality is that planting should have started with the corn planting with a focus on the ultimate goal of getting an alfalfa crop seeded this fall and planting plenty of time to establish and be ready for a strong performance next year. There is no specific cutoff date for seeding alfalfa in the fall. Last seeding date should be based on norms for your area and a look at detailed long-term temperatures for the next 60 days after planting. One thing for certain, choosing WL alfalfa seed will provide a great opportunity to get your alfalfa quickly established and growing for winter survival.